so today I'm gonna do a really quick get ready with me and I am gonna have some makeup on but very minimal I'm about to go and do some volunteer work with my husband and I'm pushing for time so I thought I would get in here and just kind of turn on the camera I will try to list everything that I'm using just in case you're interested down below uh, of course I'm going to do my skincare and uh, right now I'm just putting on a hyaluronic acid and I'm gonna go with the cream a sunscreen and for days like this where I'm just uh, just kind of hanging out with my husband I still want to look uh, I guess kind of cute kind of like almost a naturally cute kind of like yes okay have a good day good that was my daughter <clears throat> So yeah, I try to be, um, look reasonably cute, you know, as cute as much as I can or as old as I am. Um, let's see, I honestly believe that, you know, people, when you're married or if you're in a relationship or whatever, whatever you do or did to uh, get that person, I think that, you know, that's a good idea to continue to do it. Uh, while you all are together, I'm just using my Biosense uh, Mineral Sunscreen. I love this stuff so much. It is so good. And I'm going to take it with me and reapply it. I have some sunscreen for the body. Um, I don't have it in here with me. Uh, speaking of body, uh, I'm going to, and I... I apologize if I seem so tired. I, I am just so, so tired. Anyway, excuse me. For the body, I'm going to use my Clarence Body Fit Expert Anti. Uh, this is like an anti cellulite um, contouring uh, moisturizer. So I did a video on this a time ago talking about, and I'm going to use this on my arms. Ooh, talking too much. Talking about how I felt as though. I mean, it was a good moisturizer. I just felt as though it didn't really do um, what I wanted it to do as far as eliminating the cellulite. And another um, YouTuber, I will uh, link her information down below. She said that, um, she was like, you have to actually rub it and massage it in. So I was like, okay, all right then. So <laughs> I've been doing that, just trying it. You know, because I honestly believe, you know, if, if you know, with the products that I use, it could be operator error. I could definitely be using or doing something wrong, but um, I like to use it on my arm. So I will keep you all posted on that. But she was saying you literally have to just, you know, just keep massaging it in and working it in. So, yeah, let me go ahead and take a step. For my deodorant, I'm going to use the each and every. This is an aluminum free deodorant, you all. And this has been working for me. I tried to help my sister to it. <laughs> she was like, girl, I don't know. I heard it about, I heard about those aluminum free deodorants. And I was like, well, girl, this one works because that one really, really works. Um, for the scent of the day, I'm gonna use this fresh sugar lemon. My husband likes this. And since I'm hanging out with him, I thought I would put him something that he likes. So I'm gonna be wearing that. So I got that on. Um, I'm just gonna put on a little bit of this um, Glam Glow. Um, let me put on my glasses so I can tell you exactly what it is. This is a Glam Glow Starter Mega Illuminating Moisturizer. And this is really, really pretty. Uh, I'm just gonna put a little bit right there. And a little bit right here and right here. And maybe up here, just a little bit. Um, yeah, I've been trying some new products for my hair. 
Um, and I think that I'm liking them. They're called, well, this is called the JBN. Put the glasses on again. This is the JBN Nourishing Shine Drops. Okay, and this is made with clear. Um, I put the word over there. It's silicone free, sulfate free, uh, color safe and vegan. And that's a lot of what sold me on it. Um, I think I'm liking it so far. I'm pairing it with this JBN Complete Conditioning Mist. Um, these two paired together um, have my hair so far. It's, it's working for me. So far, I'm liking it. Um, I will have it in a favorites if it really uh, works. Um, turns out that it really works well for me. I'm going to have it in a favorites video. But um, it wasn't too expensive either. I picked it up from um, Sephora. So I'm just going to... How does that feel? I'm going to put on my brows a little bit. I'm going to wipe some of this more off. Sometimes it gets a little bit too oily when you're trying to draw in your brows. And I'm just going to fill them in just a little bit. Not much at all. Okay. Just so you just kind of know that they're there. Okay. And you all know I have to put it on my lashes I definitely am definitely going to wear some lashes other phones put on some lip gloss I like this uh, lip gloss by Juvia's Place uh, it's a clear lip gloss let me <clears throat> let me show tell you all the exact name of it this is the what is this the nourish no the Nubium glow lip balm and it's so pretty. The only thing that that is a little frustrating is that you know I have to keep reapplying it over you know a lot very frequently. So I'm gonna go ahead and wear some lashes, and I don't know um, what kind. I have you know a big pair like this. I have some um, Anastasia uh, lashes. These are kind of soft anyway. I'm thinking I might wear these. These are kind of big and extra. <laughs> I'm gonna uh, put them on my eyes and see what they look like. I want that that nice, fluttery, like, fun look. That's the look that I'm going for. Will these lashes give it to me? I don't know. We're gonna see. We are going to see. Um, yeah, so yeah, uh-huh, that's cute. That's like the look that I'm going for, that's perfect. And see, they look so large, they look really big, don't they? I know that they look so large, but that's okay. I'm gonna um, go ahead and put the glue on them. Okay, and I just like using, I'm really not picky when it comes to glue because at the end of the day, I really don't want my lap, the glue to be on there so tight. You have to, it takes like an act of Congress to get to get it off. That kind of scares me. So I'm just using some Kiss, Kiss glue. Again, I'll have everything in the link below just in case you're interested. So I like getting it on there and letting it sit so it can, you know, be tacky when I get ready to put it on there because for me, that's that's so important when you're putting on lashes. You have to let the glue get tacky. And another thing that I've been doing lately when I put on my lashes and I, this, I'll put a little bit on my lash, you know, my lash line, just a little bit. And I've just recently been doing that the past, maybe two months or so. Um, I just feel as though makes it go on a bit better and quicker it's a lot less fuss um, I don't have my mirror in here so I need to get my mirror and I'll be right back all right so back with the mirror 
and I'm gonna go ahead and put some mascara on my eyes and then I'm gonna put some glue on my lash band and then after that I'm gonna put some eyeliner on and then that will pretty much be it this is like a super quick video um, and I wish I could say this is like an everyday look because it's not this isn't this is like <laughs> me going to I'm actually going to do some work so I don't want to <laughs> put on like makeup makeup but I definitely want to have my skincare down and I've been trying some uh, stuff that I like and stuff. I'll be sharing that with you all soon. When you all go and you hang out with your husband or your significant other, like how do you all, do you wear makeup? Do you wear a full face of makeup? Do you just kind of do a natural look? Or what is it that you do? Let me know down in the comments. And my bands keep riding up. <laughs> I'm gonna have to pull them down. I feel them just sliding on up. They're just sliding up. And my hair is so pretty. It's so fuzzy. Reminds me of when my how my hair was, or me being like a little girl's hair, because it's so fuzzy. See how fuzzy that is? And I had it tied down. Anyway, so I just like to put a little bit of glue on my lash line. Just a little bit. Oh, like that almost got my eyes. I just feel like it goes on better, you know? When you have the glue on your lash line and it's tacky, and then when you have it, when you have it on your, uh, your lashes. All right, so yeah, I got that form up now. And I'm gonna let it sit for a second. You know, I got a birthday gift from um, Sephora. You know how you get a birthday gift. And I got the, uh, where are glasses at? Let's get the glasses so we can see. So they gave you options, right? So the option that I picked was the Tatcha Rice Wash uh, Soft Cream Cleanser. This, and I also decided to get the Tatcha Replen Replenishing Japanese Purple Rice for Dry Skin, these two. And I have to say, this cleanser, I like this cleanser a lot. It's been around like forever, so I'm sure all of you all have tried it. Um, I like it a lot. If you haven't or if you have tried it and you like it, let me know. If you try it and you don't like it, let me know. I'm trying to get these lashes tangy. Also, if you tried um, this hairline by JBN, know how you like that as well so I think I kind of got it tacky I'm gonna go ahead and I'll just use my um, magnifying side of my mirror and I look down and and that's it and then you look down and it pretty much sticks to itself it's going to act actually grab on to the glue that you already have like on your lash line so I'm gonna do this side and look down and place the lashes on and it's just as simple as that okay it doesn't take a lot so now I'm just going to a little bit of eyeliner, okay, my Sephora eyeliner, and I'm gonna apply that very close to my lash line, as close as possible. And 
okay and then I'm gonna do that to the other side and there you go that is it that's gonna dry and honestly guys that's it to my look that's all that I want to do very simple let me know down in the comments when you get ready to go out and you don't want to do a lot at all do you keep it as minimalistic as I or do you include some other steps let me know down in the comments I'd love to hear about it thank you so much for tuning in and until my next video smooches